Yo, what's up? This your boy Seventh Dad from Let's Talk Freedom, and I'm here today to do my review of something y'all might not know that I'm into. But I happen to be a huge Star Wars fan. Have been since I was a little jit. Came up in the '80s, so I found a company on Facebook called Kyberlight, and they make custom, customizable, full, dualable lightsabers. And as you can see, this is the box it comes in. Nice, right? Full clamshell box. And this one happens to be, let's see which one this is. This is the V5 Silver Kit. This is just a night kit. It comes with bare minimum accessories, the extra accessories in there is from the Indiegogo campaign. So, these sleeves were a gift for promoting in from, you know, uh, I guess backing the thing so early. Along with this pommel and this emitter piece. Now to tell you, these things are all made out of really nice aluminum and some of this shit's got some weight to it. As a pack comes, comes with an emitter piece, comes with a pommel piece, The blade, which they say with this blade right here, it is indestructible. And if you can break this blade, they will gladly replace it for free for life. I emailed the company. I said, look, I'm about to fuck this shit up. And I'm going to try to break these fucking blades. Can I break them? Will y'all replace them? And they told me, dead ass, like Mel Gibson said in Signs, swing away. I'm like, okay, okay. Personally, I would have used a thing from Taken. Uh, from uh, what was it? Was it Taken? Yeah, Taken. I'm like, good luck. But that's what they tell me. That's what they tell me. Also included in the box is your little bag of. Connector pieces and whatnot for the screws and all. The charger. Allen tool. Yeah. And the thing we've all been waiting for. The hill. I mean, already, it sounds dope. And I happen to know there's a lot of features to these. I think it's 17 different colors, three different sound fonts, flash on crash, which is amazing for the price point. We paid for I paid for this. It's amazing for it to be that price. So, let's put this bitch together. I like this little gray piece here, so we're gonna we're gonna run with this one. I know you just slide it over, and then you got little spots right there to line up for the holes. So pull these little things out here. Man, we're trying to open a bag of cocaine. Fuck. All right, here we go. Go ahead and put the cover tech piece in. <laughs> Line all this bullshit up. All right, it's got another hole on the other side. Put 
screw in. Put this palm on. Just like that. Let's see. We want silver. I guess we'll go with black for now. We have multiple screw setups over here, so you gotta find the right way for it to go on. One screw here. And then the other one is gonna be this little, little flat thing. You can't really see it. That's gonna be your blade retention screw. Open this blade up. It came with plastic wrap for protection. It's like trying to take the wrapper off of a Slim Jim. Yeah, I just throw the paper and everything on the floor. Don't tell nobody, my girl will kill me. And in we go. Let's tighten the blade retention screw, keep the blade in place, hit these lights. We hit the button for the block of blaster. All right, we'll turn this off. All right, let's go to the next sound font. This right here is your on button. This is your aux button. This is your charging port. Hit the aux button when it's off to change the sound font. Then a quick press. And I thought this feature was cool too. Press the power button three times. It makes a little noise and then <coughs> just rotate the blade. And it goes to different colors. And we'll go with Mace Windu Purple. Sounds like a good idea. Flash on crash, change the colors, change the sound fonts, on demand blaster hits, on demand lockup. That's for the lockup. I mean, overall, this is pretty cool. I, I, I like this. This is pretty dope. And if you happen to have two of these boys, they have a pommel piece where you can connect them together and do the whole Darth Maul staff type shit.
So this is the silver kit. The V5 Silver Knight kit. From Kyber Light. Overall, it's got a really good weight to it. Smooth swing. It's got good balance. I mean, I'm most definitely a fan. Most definitely a fan. Now, this is basically an RGB blade. It's not like, you know, the fancy <laughs> Neo Pixel or anything like that. But for doing purposes, okay, I'll see you. Could most definitely be a good look. And we'll just take this one and set it behind me. Because we're not done yet. We are going to take this box and put it to the side. And then we're going to pull up this box. Now, I've already had this box. This one came around Christmas time. I was super excited to get this. Uh, in, I think, October, September, September, October, something like that. Capital Flag themselves, they had a contest. Uh, I think it was the Power of Two contest or the Rule of Two. And I sent my girlfriend a link to it like, yo, look. End of this contest, let's see what happens. And we ended up winning. Like, I don't think we ever won anything over Facebook before. Like, who wins shit? But we won. So we got two Power Light V5 Master Packs. So we've already been opened up played with these and since I already bought the silver kit I got this one in matte black and this is the master kit everything that came with it they got these different sleeve choices I'm going to go with the silver one. We've got these different emitter pieces. Now, this one is cool. It's a little heavy. It's got some weight to it. I prefer this one. I like, I like the look of this. I think it's a good look. Then we have pommel pieces. We've got these three pommel pieces that came with it. And this one, you know, we're playing run in the mill. So we're just going to put that off to the side. Nobody wants to use this plain shit. This Mamma Jamma is heavy. And I see myself smacking myself in the face with this thing, trying to flip the blade around. So we're going to put this one up also. This one right here has got a good classic look. Nice weight to it for the speaker to hear on the bottom so we're gonna go with this one the safe way same thing comes with the all the screws and utensils you need charger and all and the hilt comes in a really nice matte black so first thing first we're gonna pop this Mamma Jam on. Cover Tech Wheel. And as you see with the other blade, this really does not take that long to set up. Like. You can even have, you know, like maybe a 10-year-old, 11-year-old kid do this. I mean, as long as they got, like, good dexterity and they're good with small pieces. Like, yeah, you can have small kids do this. I would let my 8-year-old son do this, but I still don't trust my son with a butter knife. So, no small pieces for you, sir. Sorry, guy.
I, I don't think I can trust myself with small pieces. Hold on. All right. Everything lined up. There we go. And come to the other side. I know on the Cobra Light videos they say to screw in the pommel first, which is probably a good idea, but I don't ever follow instructions. I'm terrible at that shit. Alright. And we are going to use a quick thumb screw for this. And alright. I already have the blade retention screw in here because, like I said, I have been playing with this because I'm a giant kid and I couldn't wait to do the video, so I have to play with it now. The other nose, screw the blade in. And we'll cut the lights off one more time. The same thing as the other one. I like this right here, how you can see through it. It's kind of like a crystal chamber. All the same effects, sounds. The only difference is between the master kit and the night kit is you get more pieces to choose from to kind of swag your uh, lightsaber out. <laughs> this one. Here we have it. We have two kits, a night kit and the master kit. Overall, I mean, they've seen firm. So uh yeah. Stay tuned cuz I will be testing these things. First with my son. Then with my girlfriend, and then with my homeboys. And you're going to see the progression of ridiculousness and durability these blades have when we uh, go through me dueling my son, me dueling my girlfriend, and then me dueling my homeboys. This is 7th Dad for Let's Talk Freedom, Let's Talk Lightsabers. Holla at your boy and stay tuned for the next video.